Hey, please watch this short video and you will get the answers you are seeking. First thing you want to do is come up to the top left and click on the settings screen. Next thing you want to do is come up to the right to system settings. You want to come down to add-ons and you also want to come up to the right and turn on show notifications. Also turn on unknown sources. Once you do that, it's going to prompt you with a warning. Hit yes. Next, what you want to do, both of these should be white on the right hand side and it should say install this automatically. Next thing you should do is hit back, come down to file manager and come down to add source. After you click on add source, you want to click on none. And then we're going to type in the URL for this build, the directs build. Alright, so make sure you type in that correctly, don't make any mistakes, make sure your punctuations are correct. Hit OK, come down, we can give it a name, it really doesn't matter, it's just a reference point, and then we're going to type in, no, click on OK. Get back again, let's go back to the main menu, and we're going to click on add-ons. You want to come over to the top left-hand side of your screen and click on the installation box. Next thing you want to do is come down to install from zip file and click on that. Let's come to directs. If you didn't put the period, it'll be in alphabetical order, so it'll still be near the top. All right, so once you're there, I'm going to click on the plugin program, directs wizard. We're going to wait for the pop up on the top right of our screen. All right, so once we get the pop up on the top, right of our screen. We're going to hit back. It's going to automatically give us a pop-up. Let's hit remind me later or dismiss. Either one is fine. And then it's going to give us another pop-up. Let's hit continue. And let's click on build menu. All right, hit dismiss. All right, so once we do all that, we're gonna, it's going to take us to the screen with all the builds for the race build. As you can see, we have um, five different servers. So the reason we have multiple servers, some servers may run slower than others. So if one, if you click on one and it doesn't go to speed that you would like, cancel it and then you can open a different, different server and it may go 10 times faster. So for this video, I'm going to click on server one, the one at the top. And then let's go ahead and click on fresh install. You can do standard install if you like. Fresh install cleans out everything on your system and then installs the build by itself. Hold on. Then we want to click on continue. All right, as you can see, we got good speed, so it should be done in about 10 seconds. If yours take longer, that's not a problem. Very small build, 170 megabytes. All right, once this finishes, it's going to say force close. Anytime you add a new build, you want to close out everything on your system and open it back up. If you have trouble closing out everything on your system, you can un unplug your device and then plug it back in. Results at the beginning of open up, opening up a new build, it's going to load up everything. It's going to say that it's updating everything. As you see at the bottom right of your screen, you see plenty of updates and installations right here. So you want to let that go for about two or three minutes to get everything running smoothly onto your device. And you can see this is Direct Build. It works good. Compatible with both Kodi 17.6 and Kodi 18 as well. This is version 9.6 and it was updated about two or three days ago. As you can see at the top right of the screen, 9.25. So on the menu screen, you see we have multiple different selections. We have the movie section, TV show section, family, Direct TV, paid TV, free TV. Sports section is very popular right now because everybody's watching sports. We got a music section, we got APK, APK section. As you can see, APKs are like their own, their own um, add-ons, but you can also find them within this build and use them that way. Miscellaneous, got system if you want to mess around with some different things like skins, ch change the colors, or change the order of your add um, of your menu. Also got an add-on section, which is very good. If you come to video add-ons, it'll show you, as you see at the bottom right, it's still updating. But if you come over here to video add-ons, click on that, it'll show you all the add-ons that come with the build. So if you're looking for a specific 
add-on, you can find it here. So it's a nice selection of all the bills that all the add-ons that come with the bill. I changed my life completely by using this system. Please do yourself a favor and try it out. I know you'll be amazed.